Welcome to the residency at Hoya Airs in Spain. And I was um, here with six other residents. And my purpose for being here was to explore painting and a variety of materials. So I made these small books before flying and they fit in the suitcase well and did some images uh, of the landscapes every day. And the, um, I did collage, make collage papers. The weather here has been very unusual in the first week, although it's warming up now. It was very wet, stormy with lightning. The clouds changed amazingly. And uh, I like to prepare different undersurfaces for the paintings. And so this piece here is, I put outside and it got washed off, the paint got washed off three times. And then I decided it would be fun to experiment and paint with the clay. And there are three different colors of the clay, the darker clay, the red clay, and the brown clay. And then I found a, a cardboard box and was able to display it. Um, and this one with the materials and the papers that I was doing for the underpaintings, I made another little booklet with the collage papers of what I did. So this is our rubbings. This is putting the paper outside, which was a um, thin paper. And these are rubbings of local plants that are in the area that were pressed. And this was um, just the, my imagination of being in the field with the almond trees as Van Gogh did when he sat in the fields and painted them with all his orange colors. And I love the curdicues of the, the trunks, the olive trees and the almond trees. I would go outside and do small little vignettes of the landscapes. And um, that was fun. And this was um, one of the stormy days and uh, doing the clouds and the landscape. And uh, that was on another artist's piece of paper that didn't have all the folds in it. Yesterday I was out painting at sunrise and using regular blue acrylic paint. And I um, yeah, just loved being in nature and loved being in the, the ambience of the the park and the property. This piece was um, one of the first pieces I did when I arrived. I wanted to use this um, paper to record the plants and the different textures on the walls and the rocks and those kinds of things. And this was sitting in the field um, a couple of days ago where I painted with the clay and also charcoal and mixed media. And the piece at the end is um, one of my experiments, or maybe failed experiments, but it was, there's five layers of watercolor and acrylic paint on the piece. And what happened was the rain washed away for two days of the whole painting, and then that was what was left with the textures. And, and then this is some experimenting with the, the clay and painting on cardboard. Um, and which is really funny because you can carve out the cardboard and you can use the texture of the clay and uh, I'm going to explore that further. And this is just painting with, with the clay and doing layers because the, it was so wet the first week they have the um, areas where the, the rain comes down the mountain and forms riverbeds and of clay basically and uh, I'm wanting to, do, to go back to one of the places I've seen, which I'll do probably this, this week, and uh, do some nature paintings. And this is a white clay um, where I made this figure, so it's called the Three Sisters. And that was a lingering memory of my trip last year to an artist residency in Italy. And and I was exploring Rome with um, five nuns and a father. So this is the clay. 
it becomes um, it's very soft when I put it down and it's quite hard now so I just have to put water on it and it gets reconstituted so that's very easy to work with. And the rocks, many beautiful rocks with flint and stones. So this was one rock that I found on the, my walk actually. I, I broke it into pieces but I just love that form. It reminded me of my sculpture that I did. And these are some samples of the clay, the red clay, the white clay, and the brown clay. You can see my finger marks in there, gathering up the clay to, to paint with. And uh, yeah, so I've got three more days left of the residency, and I'm having a wonderful time, and just had a fabulous visit from friends, and we went out to another little town called Maria, and I've had an absolutely wonderful day, and and blessings to you all, and thank you for your attention. <laughs> <laughs>